hello, it's Pat AJ Post Show for Monday. It's Monday the 17th. Yep. 14th. <laughs> 15. Yes. Yeah, this is 17. This is 17. <laughs> right on. Hey, look who's back, everybody. Yay. AJ's here. Happy to be back. Missed you guys. How are you feeling? You good? I'm kind of tired now with a headache, yeah. but I, I'm okay. It's, Can you breathe? Yeah, I'm a little wheezy. <laughs> no, the best part is about all this. Didn't uh, you got free stuff for being sick? This is what you. This is what happens when you were a kid. Because you said your sister as a kid had severe asthma, right? She did. When we were kids, she had terrible. And I remember her being in the hospital a lot. And she would go into the hospital, and what would happen? My dad would buy us toys. He would buy one for yeah. me, so I didn't feel left out. And then he buy a yeah. little something for her. This one gets a little care package from my godmother, who oh lives my out gosh. in California. I did. Sends her a couple of bottles of the vino from California, and says, "Hey, when you're feeling better, I hope you crack these open. Look oh. at you. You got a delt toy. No, it stinks as I'm on so much medication right now. You I ain't drinking right uh, now. Yeah, I, I know. Like <laughs> all of them are gonna be like, don't drink. So adventures and traveling. I uh, completed Pat's ultimate sports weekend it's all over friday saw the uh blackhawks and red wings mix it up at the joe saturday flew to chicago sunday watched the bears sunday night flew back home to flint uh of course if you ever want to be delayed or have your flight canceled just be on the same flight as him find out where pat's going <laughs> it, it, it doesn't matter i kid you not when i got to o'hare yesterday i had to walk to some far off gate and um I look out like the side window of the gate. I didn't even tell you this yet. No. There were like 12 cop cars and emergency oh. vehicles, lights are on. I'm like, oh yeah, here we go. For a shut down O'Hare again. It's like some sort of good yeah. fellas heist or something. Yeah, because the last time they shut down O'Hare, oh yeah. I was supposed to fly there then too. But so uh, our flight gets delayed, of course, because it, it's 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 my flight. And then we end up on the plane, and then you're doing the thing where you're stuck on the plane. Yeah, that's awful. Uh, you are so ready to leave uh, by that point. Like, they, they, they had to de-ice it, and then they had to wait for fuel, and then someone had a laid bag coming in. And what happens, I watch two salesmen <coughs> start basically trying to out-pitch each other in <laughs> front of me. Because <laughs> people start yakking. You sure. get bored on the plane. And... These two start talking. One guy is like, I just bought this automotive shop up on Dort Highway. Another guy owns some kind of horse farm. And they're trying to pitch each other Fine. to basically go to each other's business. Like the one guy's like, yeah, we do it all. I'll take care of your shocks, your struts, a little bit of engine work. You need your brakes done. <laughs> and then the other guy's like, oh, yeah, we give great riding lessons. You got any kids? Oh, you do have kids. Why don't you bring them on by? Wow. We can set them up with some lessons over at our indoor horse riding That's park. That's the worst flight ever. <laughs> They're, they're, they're swapping cards and stuff, and I'm sitting there just, like, watching this ping-pong action in front of me. It's crazy. So I realized this weekend that I'm old, and I haven't been in a play for a really, really long time. <laughs> I could have told you you were old. So this was the opening weekend of Miracle on 34th Street with the Flint Community Players, which I'm in. It was a lot of fun, but I haven't done any theater since before my son was born, since 2004. So it's wow. been 10 years. Um, also, something that didn't really exist back then were smartphones. <laughs> I had a phone back then, but it was like one of those big chunky emergency phones in case my old car broke down. Um, I would never bring my phone on stage ever for any reason, and apparently I'm the only one. A lot of the people bring their. Are you kidding me? No, they're in their costumes, like the pockets of their costumes. Oh my goodness! And then as soon as they get off stage, and I mean like right off the wings, they're like on their phone, and I'm like I. First of all, know that if I brought my phone with me, it, it would, would fall off. out yeah. on stage. And it would be so embarrassing. Or it would go off. I'm just too scared to do that. But I just realized, I'm like, one of the things that's changed all is people fine. bring their smartphones on stage. This is all I could never do that, ever. This is all I'm envisioning. Why, yes, little girl, I am set. Oh. Hello? <laughs> nope. I'll bring home the milk after I'm done with this. That's all I, I see. I could never do it. Because my phone would go off or fall out and break That's on funny. stage. So, not me. No uh, way. Well, go watch AJ and all of our Flint community players drop phones on stage. Uh, hey, yeah, while you're here watching the YouTube video, click on the button below us. That is the subscribe button. Takes you automatically to the subscribe page of the Cars on my YouTube channel. And then there we are. We're on your, your, your video all the time. So, okay. Have a good day. Bye. Bye.